Universe is dependent or independent? Um, undecided. What does that mean? What does well, it mean, well, well, it means, well, it means I think the scientific inquiry that would allow me to answer that question. What's, what's, what's the scientific inquiry? Has not, been, has not been concluded. Well, you know, we have a theory of, we have all the, this, this kind of physical theories about how the universe came to being. We have elements, we have red shift, we have the cosmic micro background. That's fine, these are all theories. Which, which is kind of, which is all these things which give us evidence of the Big Bang. That's fine, these are all theories, but what I'm saying is very simple. The universe is it, it's either dependent or independent. It's a very simple question. Like, either well, you're going to say that the, right, the universe right, but, is dependent right, but this, but the or reason, it's independent. Sure, but the reason why I'm mentioning that is because this all seems to depend on the nature of the Big Bang or what, if anything, preceded the Big Bang. It's irrelevant to the equation. Why what is preceded it before it why or is it after it, it it's very simple. It's either dependent or independent. It's not, it's not like a trick question. It's just simple. It's no, I, I know. It's, but it's yes, but I, mean, I now understand. But I'm saying I can't. I can't answer the question well, without. Well, if you can't answer the question, then we cannot go forward because it just Why now not? everything's on. Because you're not. You're not answering a very simple question, which is. Even the universe, you, you have, can see it's independent. I can't, I can't answer the question because I don't, okay, have, can't be I don't, have, I don't have access to the you, knowledge you, you of you the entire universe. You don't, you don't need to. I speak to many atheists. They'll come and say, you know, I believe the universe is independent, meaning that it is free from any need. It's, it's, the, in, the universe is the necessary thing. And I say, oh, well, okay, okay, let's talk about that. Or they come and say, well, the universe is dependent. I say, well, let's talk about that. So if you're choosing not to, then the, the argument just stops here. It's, it's, there's nothing else I can do for it. Okay. Like, yeah. Well, I, I don't see why. So, so you don't think it's ever correct to say, I don't know no, no, about it? No, it's not correct. It's, it's just, I believe something. it's sometimes, not yourself, but some atheists use it as a cop-out. It's just like, oh, I, I don't know. I don't know. What the hell does that mean? I don't know. It's okay. I respect it. But what I'm saying is that it's, it's the it's universe. It's not a cop-out because, because <laughs> if, someone is, if someone proposes an argument, yeah. In order to contend with it, I don't need to necessarily propose a counter argument. I don't, I don't want to counter. I can just, I can just poke, poke holes. You know, extraordinary claims require extraordinary evidence. Exactly, like you say, that God doesn't exist. That's an extraordinary claim that requires extraordinary evidence. So what I'm saying is very simple. The universe is either, either dependent or independent. If you say I do not know, the conversation ends here because it can't go forward. It's like you're saying I do not know and I, I can't ask. I'll say I'll respect it's that. Not an end, it's not an end. Have to end the conversation. Well, of course. It, well, it, I'm going to say it, it, just, okay. it, just mean, it means it means there are other lines of inquiry okay. that we okay. need to Okay. No, no, there isn't. The universe is either dependent or independent. There is no dependent, independent. I don't want. I don't know. I don't know. Is okay. Finish the discussion. Why? But it might be more. There, you don't know about the law of the excluded middle. Might be what's, more. What's, what's the law of the excluded middle? The idea that given a binary or not necessarily binary a, a finite set of possibilities to answer a question there may always be a possibility you haven't considered or okay. you haven't, or you so, haven't okay, included no into the equation no, I don't, no, I don't know I don't, know, I don't, I don't, know, I don't know I don't know that in this particular example that, that is the case okay. and, it, and even if it were I don't know what those other possibilities would be okay so for, let's talk with what we know dependent independent you, I don't know you're you're, you're, which one are you going with uh, I, don't, I don't know. I don't know. Okay, so what I'm saying is, okay, then the, the conversation ends here. There's nothing I can do. I'm just, okay, you don't know, then I'll just say that's fine. I respect you don't want to know or don't, you think you don't know, okay? The that's conversation ends. That's what he's trying to say. It's huh? both ways. If it's true for him, it's also true for you, right? No, because he's saying, I don't know. I'm saying, I know. I know that the universe is not independent. So I'm asking him, is it dependent or independent? He's saying, I don't know. I go, well, okay, the conversation has to end here because we can't go forward. It's like, so, well, oh. ah, so you're saying the US is not, you're saying the US is dependent on this necessary yeah. Yeah, 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 eternal yeah. No, being. No, 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 I, I believe it is exists. dependent right. for my reasons, but I'm saying, I need to know what you believe so we can discuss that. Because ah, you're saying, no, I don't know, then I'm saying, okay, there's no discussion. I'm going to have to Well, pray. But, I, but I think there's something interesting there because <laughs> you're, you're assigning all those traits to this being which you assert the universe is dependent on. I, I, I can come to the why I'm could, that. Now I could argue that the universe has all those traits. Okay, thank you. Good. And, good, and okay. so and so the universe is doesn't need doesn't need Perfect. is independent doesn't need Perfect. to be dependent on a thing. Yes, good. So, so what now? I'm not necessarily making that claim. No, no you have to make that. But claim. what yeah. what what gives you the ability to okay, decide so those saying, traits are tied to the universe okay, good. or something? So what I'm saying is this: yeah? the reason why you're saying that is because you know. If you say dependent, then you're admitting that it depends on something. If you say it's independent, now yes. you've admitted that well, it will require something that is independent. Of course. All you've done is ascribe it to the universe, and all I have to do uh, is prove yes. to you why the but universe even, is not independent. But, dependent. but even if I, but even if I say the universe is dependent on something, yes. Why does that thing have to be God? Okay, both of them. No, not God. I, I haven't gone to God there. I'm, I oh, want okay. to. I want to make you a, a deist before I make you a theist. Yeah. Uh, 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 so what I'm saying is this. When you come and say it is dependent, the question I'll ask you is, what does it depend on? I'm not bringing God to the picture just yet. So what I'm saying is, 
I would sure. say to you, what does it depend on? It cannot depend on something that is depends on something else. It depends on something which is infinite regress. That's a fallacy. Sure, that's the so then, 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 argument. if you said Fine. to me, it is independent, then I'll say to you, good. You have affirmed a necessary being. All you did is ascribe it to the universe. Now I'm going to prove to you why it cannot be the universe. Then you're going to have to say, okay, once you've proven to me, then we're going to say, well, the necessary being has to be something outside the universe. Then we're going to go and make our pathway to God. So I'm going to go, just for the sake of the, the, the discussion here, that you say that, like you said, um, oh, let's suppose it is independent. Good. So when you claim or when you want to say with the argument, say it's independent, you have acknowledged what? That we require a necessary being, all you've done is ascribed it to the universe. Now, I'm going to tell you why the universe cannot be necessary and it's not independent. Why? Because the universe is composed of pieces. The universe could be any other way. What do you, you mean it's composed of pieces? Pieces. Like for example, we are a piece of it. Like, for example, the stars, uh, dark matter, uh, dark energy. You, these are all these elements that are in place that is composed by do you, it. Do you, not, do, you, do you not understand? The universe is all of those things. Exactly. That's what I'm saying. So it's composed of these pieces. Right. But it can, it can, you can see it as being composed of all these pieces or you can see it as being a singular entity. No, that's fine. But it's, it's still composed of that. For example, we have a, 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 a energy. Yeah. Right. We have a set amount of energy within our universe. Yeah? Yes. Okay. That energy is pieces. It's, it's composed by those pieces. That's what makes our universe. The, anything that is composed by pieces cannot be independent. Point number two. Why not? Because it cannot be. Because it has the attributes of being any other way. So we can look. The fact that there's I, a set. I don't, I don't, I don't see. The, so you're saying that the fact that there are, well, not countless, but yes. a huge number of many yes. conf possible configurations yes. for the universe yes. in terms of where the energy and the matter yes. is, the fundamental constants, yes. etc. All these yes. things. Yes. Why does that mean it can't be? Because it's independent. Because it's 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 limited. It, it shows that because there's a set amount of it, it shows its limitations. It is dependent. That is a dependency right there. Even though, like, for I, example... I see, this is where I'm not following you. But you don't I, need to follow I, it. I'm saying that for the... It's well, very simple. Well, anything in that's, for, well, in order my, for the argument my to make sense... My definition, anything that's <laughs> Someone composed... Someone needs to follow it. No, no, no. Well, so the audience can follow it. So the point is this. That anything that is composed of pieces cannot be independent. And anything that can be any other way. For example, we can have five trillion extra galaxies on up in, in our universe. Right. It can be any other way. Therefore, it cannot be uh, independent. We say the independent being is not composed of pieces oh, and it cannot be any other way. That's the reason why the universe is dependent. So what, you're really, what, what does okay. it depend on is the necessary being. It sounds like what you're talking about then is some yeah. kind of determinism, right? That the that if if the universe were independent, that it would it would have to be one specific way, as in as in the universe would have to have been deterministic from the start. Is that what you're saying? That, that what you're talking about there, it's, it's a bit different. You're talking about the, the, the Qadr, like what God has written. And sure, that's how but, it is. But, but when you're talking about the universe being this way or that way, yeah. what you're kind of really talking about is, is it deterministic or not, right? Yeah, well, we're saying, we're right? saying that it cannot be any other... Uh, uh, anything that can be any other way is dependent. We say God cannot be any other way. We're saying the necessary being but the reason I'm doing this is to prove to you that the universe is dependent. And if it is dependent, then it requires something that it depends on. And it cannot depend okay. on something that depends on something else. It has to depend on something that is independent. Do you think... Do you think Therefore, that's the necessary being. Do you think the universe is unique? Is what? Do you think there's one universe? Or do you think there could no, be, no, there could no. be several? We, we, we believe in this, uh, the necessary being, which is God Almighty, he could create... He's the, he's the creator. He can create many. He can create many universes. Many, many. No, I'm saying he has the uh, ability to do that. Sure. I'm talking about our universe. So if a, if a cosmologist yeah. showed you uh, evidence that there are several universes, no perhaps in series, yeah, yeah, like, no a, like a like a sort of contracting, yeah. expanding, or yeah. a sort of or a sort of in parallel multiverse theory, yeah. and different un different universes no in this model have different yeah. fundamental constants, yeah. different amounts of matter and energy. Yes, yes, yes. Would you not? So that would show, okay, universes can be lots of different ways. Yeah, exactly. Which shows that they're still dependent. Because, it's, it can, de it can, because there's yeah. multiple universes with different dimensions, whatever it is, it is still dependent. If, if it's anything that is composed of pieces and can be any other way, it's dependent. So my argument, if there's one trillion universes, still... it's still dependent. So I have to ask the question, all these universes, they are dependent. What do they depend on? The necessary being that is independent, self-sufficient, and cannot be any other way. So we say that necessary being is the one that gave rise to all these universes. Sure. Do you think that the universe, or, or just that 
reality itself knows about this concept of dependence and independence. It's irrelevant to me. What if why is that irrelevant? It's, it's, it's irrelevant why is, to me if why it knows or it doesn't know. Well, no, I don't think it, well, I don't think it is irrelevant. Because, why is because, it relevant for well, me? Because you're, because you're, you, you're asserting this model of contingency yeah. of yeah. X is dependent on Y is yeah. dependent on Z, etc. Yeah. So that you could take, in theory, any object uh, or process or, or I don't know what, what you want to draw lines around exactly and you could trace it back to something which would take you to this, to the first, being. to the necessary being, mm. right? But that's you kind of drawing lines around things in a very human way, kind of defining objects. The universe doesn't really know what these objects are. I don't right? care what the universe knows. I'm talking about what you know. Why You're using your logical why rationality. Why, why don't you care because, about because, what the universe because knows? Of course, I'm not going to care what the universe knows because I don't believe the universe has a conscious. So I'm talking to someone who has a conscious being who can right, make rational but you, decisions, but you do which believe, is yourself. Right, but you do believe. Presumably, and correct me if I'm wrong, that the necessary being that precedes the universe has a conscience. No, we don't. We don't. We don't say conscious. We say that he has a will. He has a will that he wills the the, the, the di universe comes to be. How are you well, the, the conscious is because, because and consciousness. Will. What does consciousness mean? What's the definition? We don't ascribe things like necessary, like you know, to, to God in that sense. So we're seeing that I don't need to know that. You know, for example, that oh. you exist. You're speaking to me. Yes. You use so your now there is, So now there is something that you don't need to know. Yes. Whereas previously, when you told me that I don't need to know what the yeah. cause of the universe is, you said that was that was strange of me. But you what, seen, what cause of the universe? But you don't need to know. What cause of the universe? The the the, the necessary being, or, the, or not even necessary, the necessary no, I said, being. Yeah, the he has, that, I the said he has a will. Proceeds. I said I can't say consciousness. So there is some, so there's something you don't know. No, I do know that he exists. Like I exist and but, he exists. No, My existence and his yes, is not the yes, same thing. Yes, but you don't. But I'm know. not going to say he has a consciousness. Yes, yes, but you don't know what his. Whether he has a conscience. Oh no no, I know his, I know his attributes, but I don't know his internal like. No, you don't. You don't yeah. know the mind of no. Yeah, I, yeah, I'm, not, I'm, not, I'm not expecting you to know yeah, the mind of God that's, if, that's God, if God exists. Yes. Yeah. But it seems to me you don't even seem to know what the nature, what the structure. No no no, we know we know, we know we know for example how we know attributes. Know, stuff. For example, you know that? that's the reason why when we say there's a necessary being, when we prove that by by proving that the universe is dependent. Now that necessary being has to have certain attributes. Why? Because if he is the one that the universe depends on, that means he willed. He has the power of will. So now we're giving attributes to that God. We're making it now personal. We're coming to theism now, which is what? That God had this necessary being, shall I say, has the power of willing something. So he willed the universe to be. So it means he has a will. There is, there is information in the universe. That means he has to be the all-knowing. There is power in the universe. He has to be the all-powerful. So what I'm saying why is do, now. What? Why does he have to be all very simple? When you look at knowledge. when you look at a picture, sure, surely someone could create some. No, I, I, no, no. Because I, I could create I could create a computer a computer simulation yes. of something, yeah. and I wouldn't necessarily know all the possible pieces of information yeah, that's, inside you're a human that simulation. Being, but, there God, are to know. but God knows every. Why does Why does God know? Well, because everything? he has to. Because because he's why necessary. He to, because he's necessary, he cannot have a deficiency of not deficiency of not knowing. That's why we say he has to be the all knowing. So do you see when we give these attributes to God is because he is ultimately perfect. The necessary being is the absolute source where everything began and it stops. So that's why we're seeing he has to have a will. He has to be all knowing. He is the all powerful. This is in a nutshell. That's what I mean. I, what, I just don't get how you reverse engineering that. You, engineering. You, you seem to be saying <laughs> that the you know, we're here and the universe we're in yep. had it's, to have this dependent. necessary yep. is yep. has to be contingent perfect. on this necessary being. Yep. Through the, but you're, and you seem to be arguing that through this kind of general principle of contingency. Yeah, I mean, I think, I think. I think but I mean, I mean, just if you if you apply the principle more generally, I mean, can you point to a more mundane example of no. some of X that's contingent on Y, no, where no. X knows about? No, it's, I think it's very simple. Because, no, because, right? Because think, because think, because because your necessary being yeah. God's. Um, Jab, sorry, is Jabby's is dower table still there? Because I had my pack lunch. It's, it's it's in a black bag. Did they pack it up? Oh yeah, it's underneath there, bro. Can you? It's a black bag. It's like a pack lunch. Right. Sorry. Because your because your necessary yeah. being God concept is yeah. is unique. It's a yeah. it's a special yeah. with regards to this yeah. principle of contingency that yeah. you're asserting. Yeah. That special quality. You you just you seem to be asserting it because oh well then how well if we didn't if you didn't yeah. have that quality yeah. it's, it's, then it's, it's, how it's else because it's called the brute fact. That's, that's what it is. So, well, no, it's an old brute fact. It's a brute assertion that you're making. It's a brute fact. 
Well, if it was a brute fact, if it was a brute fact, you wouldn't need to prove I, it, would I, you? I, it would just no, no, it, would, no, it, would, no. it would just be self-evident. No, 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 it is self-evident. You're the but one it, who's, no, it's you, no, it's not. No, 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 it's not. No, it's not. No, it's not self-evident because you've you've had to show this whole line of reasoning. Oh no, 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 it's not. together, so it's not self-evident. It's self-evident because the thing is, when I made these arguments, you didn't bring one counter. Not one counter which shows it is it's, it's, it's self evident. I've given, I've given several counters. I've pointed, you, you pointed, not, I pointed you, out, you I pointed out not, several leaps of logic bring, in your, you in your bring, argument. You did not bring one counter. Just my pack on chef. Show me one counter you brought to my condition argument. Yeah, black flag. Show me one one argument you brought to my condition argument. One. There's no there's no there's leap of, there's no leap of logic that you, you can make you between saying we have the universe and saying there must have been a natural just thing. Let, that no, just, no, just let you're not you're not you because as an no, as a human observer just admit, you're not you're look, not you're not outside look, the universe you can't I don't need observe to. Look, just Why admit, not? look just admit you did not bring a counter you even actually at one moment stuttered and said I'm just going to say I don't know because you realize because the moment you say dependent or independency you know that it's going to lead to an unnecessary being and that's what happened well, I'm, just, and, and, I'm just exploring and there's, nothing wrong. there's nothing wrong with that look at no. the end of the day i've made my arguments for the viewers that are watching it's crystal clear so i would say in a nutshell my i am dependent of eating food uh, my wife made food i'm dependent on that i have to go eat i'm hungry so i depend on this and this depends on many other things. There cannot be even regress of dependent things. I also depend on prey. I need to go pray. So I think, look, let's agree to this. But these, but, 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 these are, but these are all just these are all just like humans. That you don't depend on that food. You could, of course, you I depend could, on you, this food. You could stop eating. This food is delicious. I mean, are you trying to say to my wife that she doesn't make nice food? What are you trying to say? That's not. Hold up for a second. You know, you know that's not what. You know that's not what. You know that's not what I'm trying to say. Now I'm dependent. If I don't eat, I'll die. Right, exactly, but like but that's but eat, that's but, 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 but this is but this is my point. The universe yeah. doesn't know about. I don't care if it knows or not. It's not conscious. Why? Do you have evidence the universe is conscious? No. no. So then, why are you talking about? Uh, does it know? The universe knows. Like it's a being. I it's, talk to. It's hey, an, universe. It's, uh, hello. It's, it's an it's an anthropomorphization. Yes. Exactly. But it but it's it's an analogy to. No, no, no. To, but to you're, you're asking me. Does the universe know? I don't believe the universe has the faculties to know. It's, it's, but then, it's, but then, it's inanimate. But it's, exactly. It's inanimate. But then, but it's it, quite. But then, your your whole model of contingency doesn't yes. make any sense because how does it make sense? I'm because, telling you the universe. Because, because the, you're the because I'll, I'll tell you why. Yeah, because you're asserting you're asserting the existence of contingency in, in a, an objective way. Yes. Correct. The universe does not need if, to know that. But it does because no, it because it, if can, it does okay, it second. does your it does it does it no 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 hold on no are you dependent don't 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 distract me with example. I'm if, distracted. You know, if, I'm speaking to you, if the universe doesn't under, doesn't have it, this principle, a physical law of contingency built into it, what? and then you come along and it's assert, a, it's, it's and a assert, reality. It's not built in. It's a reality. <sighs> but then, if it was a reality, it would be a, a physical law, like no, but you're saying dynamics the universe or gravity. Should, no, no, but you're saying the universe should be conscious of. No, the no, 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 no. I'm not. No, I'm not saying. That. Oh, sorry, okay, what's I was, I'm making. I'm making an analogy. I'm not saying it should be conscious of that. I'm not okay. saying the universe is conscious. Okay, good. When I say the universe knows something, yeah. what I really mean is the universe has a physical law or is, is self-consistent okay. with respect to this it particular... It is. self-consistent that it depends on other things for its survival. But in order for that to make sense, there needs to be a consistent there is. kind of way to describe there is. contingency. Everything, look, very simple. How, how, how can you physically... What, what, what does contingency look, look like look, physically? Look, let me tell you something. Are you serious? Or even in a metaphor. Or even in a metaphor. What, does, what does contingency look physically? What do you I mean? I don't mean. I don't mean in terms of. Mean? I don't mean visually. No, what do you mean? I don't get it. What do you mean looks physical? Look, because sure we can. We can do. We can do experiments to, to. We can do experiments with the LHC to find subatomic particles. No, no, no. no, no, you no you're talking about things that you observe that you can. T I'm telling you that this what is, idea. What is the physical anything, law look, behind look, contingency? Look, there is no. There's not a physical law. I'm telling you. A then how do you know it exists? Because I'm having a rational, logical dialogue with you, and I'm telling you. Everything in the universe is dependent. Yeah, which is something you are asserting. One second, one second. I'm asserting, and you have not brought a single argument to debunk it. I'm telling you, look, very that's boldly. Not, but that's not needed. Look, look, extraordinary I'm making, claims I'm making, I'm making require extraordinary evidence. Yes, and it you're is making not extraordinary me, claims that God doesn't me exist. And to I'm, refute your claim, it's up to you so to saying, support your claim, you're the one which you are not evidence. doing. So, I'm what saying, is the physical the principle universe, of contingency? The universe you can't answer my question. The universe Therefore, your argument falls down completely. Thank you very much. Because you don't understand. We know who got intellectually... Fall down. We no, see that, yeah? no. I'm saying very simple. <laughs> the universe is dependent. Any everything in the universe is dependent. You can keep saying it. It's not going to make it simple. true. It doesn't make it true. Not a single argument to counter it. Therefore, if the not universe a single is dependent, argument to support it. if the universe is dependent, it requires something independent to give rise to it. Case closed. I'm dependent on this field. I'm going to go now. Thank you very much.
and you uh, depend on going and uh, re-fighting the arguments. <laughs> Take care. Thanks.